Hi, first graders. It's Mrs. Kit back again from Citizenship Academy in Syracuse. And today we are doing first grade skills, unit three, lesson nine. We are already on lesson nine. Our objectives today are to isolate and pronounce initial, medial vowel, and final sounds in spoken single syllable words. We are also going to segment and blend phonemes to form one syllable words. So today we are looking at words that have the ow sound in them. Words with the ow sound at the beginning are ouch, out, and owl. Words with the ow sound in the middle of the word are Shout, loud, round, couch, and hound. Words with the ow sound at the end are how, now, and cow. Sorry, that was hard to see what word I was pointing to with my red pointer. All right, now I am going to read a super silly short story, and I want you to touch your nose whenever you hear the ow sound. Ready? I'm going to go fast first, then we'll do it together. One night last summer, I slouched on my couch as I read a book about flowers. At a late hour, I heard a startling sound outside. Up in a church tower crouched a proud brown owl. He let out a loud shout and flew from the tower because he saw a mouse. A quick little mouse ran under the house so the proud brown owl began to pout. Remember, we're listening for the ow sound like ow. I ran into the door. Ow. All right, so now I'm going to do it with you. I'm going to touch my nose every time I hear the ow sound, right? One night last summer, I slouched on my couch as I read a book about flowers. At a late hour, I heard a startling sound outside up in a church tower crouched a proud brown owl he let out a loud shout and flew from the tower because he saw a mouse. The quick little mouse ran under a house. So the proud brown owl began to pout. Yeah, I made my nose itchy. Good job. Okay, so here are some words that make the ow sound. When we are writing the ow sound, we spell it O U. Sounds like ow. So if I'm writing the O U sound and I'm writing lowercase letters, I need to make sure that my O and my U don't come past the dotted line because they are lowercase letters. This next word that makes the ow sound is out. And again, I make sure my O and my U don't come above the dotted line and for a lowercase t, he comes a little bit above the dotted line. And then I cross him right on the dotted line. This word is 
Mm-ow. Mouth. These are all lowercase letters. So I make sure my M and my O, my U, all stay below the dotted line. My lowercase t comes above the dotted line just a little bit. Then I cross him right at the dotted line. My lowercase h does come up to the top line and go straight down. And then when I give him a hump, he only touches the dotted line. One more. Let's see. S-H together sounds like shh, out, shout. So if I am drawing my lowercase s, I make sure it does not come above the dotted line. My lowercase h touches the top line, goes straight down. My hump does not go over the dotted line. Then my o and my u stay below the dotted line. And my uppercase T starts right here, goes straight down, and then I cross him at the dotted line. Nice job. All right, number one, let's read these words that have the ow sound in them. This first word, let's sound it out. K, O, ow, d. K, O, ow, d. Cloud. Which picture shows us a cloud? This picture is a clock. So it does not go here. We would write cloud under the cloud right here. All right, number two. Let's sound this one out. S, n, ow, t. S, n, ow, t. Snout. What is a snout? A snout is not a spider. A snout is what this arrow is pointing to, is this pig's nose is called a snout. So we would write snout under this picture right here. Next one, let's sound it out. M, ow, f. So remember T and H together sound like th. So we have M, ow, th, mouth. Where is the mouth? Looks like a mouth that is yelling. Right here. We write mouth right here. This is not a mouth. It's a dime. And it doesn't belong in your mouth. So we're not writing anything under that one. Number four. Let's sound it out. Remember when we sound this out, at the end of this word, we have C-H next to each other, which sounds like ch. Let's sound it out. K, ow, ch. K, ow, ch. Couch. Where is the couch? Right here. So we will write couch under the couch. All right, last one. Let's sound it out. Er, ow, n, d. Er, ow, n, d. Round. Which one of those pictures is round? Is a box round? No, that's silly. A ball is round, so we would write round under the basketball. 
Nice job, guys. You worked so hard today. I'm very proud of you, and I will see you again next time for Unit 3, Lesson 10. I can't wait. Have a good night. Bye-bye.